Great golf shop aligners. Let's take a look at the best spikeless summer golf shoe. We're going to use our unique rating system. We've tested all of these shoes and we've got the staff at the golf shop online here to test all these shoes, add their opinions. We've compiled the numbers and here is our top five spikeless summer golf shoes. So number five, coming in at number five, it's the Echo LT1 golf shoe. This is a lightweight, low profile golf shoe, super, super light. Low profile meaning you're gonna get your foot relatively close to the ground, so you're gonna feel that ground. It's got this very leather, kind of deluxe leather feel and look to it. It's the premium Echo Performance leather, they call it. LYTR foam and fluid form technology provides comfort, which you can feel in the shoe and around it. For comfort, they're gonna score well, I reckon. And we've also got good traction on the bottom. So the scores on the doors for the Echo LT1 style, we're gonna give this 3.7 out of five. 3.7 out of five. It's a decent looking shoe, but I think you're gonna find some more stylish ones. Comfort, 4.3, rating really good for comfort. This shoe is a very comfortable golf shoe. Traction, so how you're gonna grip on that ground, it's gonna come in at a 4.3, a good score for traction. It's got their own unique system on the bottom with this X shape. It gives great stability and good traction. When it comes to price, we're rating this at 4.1. You are gonna see some maybe better priced golf shoes. Not that this isn't a good price, it's a good price for what you're buying. It's Echo, it's a top premium brand, but it's certainly not the cheapest golf shoe. Gives the overall rating of 4.1. The number four in our list, Foot Joy, have got to make a showing. This is the Foot Joy Quantum. This is a soft foam cushion and comfortable golf shoe. Obviously it's summer. It's got their unique pattern on the bottom, durable rubber outsole. It's just really, really well-made golf shoe. Again, super, super light super comfy. The scoring for this shoe, I just want to note that all of our top five score five out of five for waterproof. So if waterproof is one of the features you're looking for in your golf shoe, they're all five out of five because they offer the exact same warranty basically for waterproofing. So when we come in with style 4.1, it is a little bit more stylish I would say from the Echo. It comes in a few different colorways. I like the high back. It does look pretty good for a foot joy kind of fashion shoe. Comfort 4.2. This is a very comfortable shoe. It'd be interesting to see if anything scores higher because when I tested this one, I did find it super comfortable. Fit wise 4.5. This shoe does offer a great fit. Not only does it come in different fits, you've got half sizes and all the sizes available. When it comes to foot joy shoes, they do cover nearly every foot size. So a good high score for fit. Traction, 4.1, not bad traction. I reckon there might be some higher score attractions. It's decent bobbling on the bottom. Maybe not the most substantial out there. And price, 4.2, a decent score for price. It's a very well-made golf shoe. It's foot joy, not a surprise, it's in our top five. Number three in our top five, bit of a curveball. Not known so much for golf shoes, but trying to make a bit of a splash in the golf uh, shoe space. Sketchers. So this is the Go Golf Tempo. Oh, this is super light, this shoe. It's got Echo Flight cushioning for max comfort, Echo Flight cushioning and lightweight made for at least 10% recycled material as well. And it does feel crazy, crazy light. Grip Flex outsole for traction. So they've got their own grip system on the bottom as well. This is again, 100% waterproof. Remember, they all offer the same idea as waterproof. This is a really good looking, stylish, street branded golf shoe, which I think is a little bit of a curve in there for lots of people. So 3.7 for styling. I think you're gonna see some more stylish golf shoes as well. Maybe a bit of a curve ball for some people's mind, sketches. So it's a different one. Obviously the, the styling is a little bit personal to the people we polled here, um, but this one came in a little lower. I think that's a bit cruel personally. Comfort, 4.6, no surprise there. Comfort, super high, it's light. This was one of the most comfortable shoes I have tested. And often the street brands, when they come over to Golf Comfort, they do excelling because they've been doing it for years in their regular brand, uh, brand, their street brand. Score for fit, 4.2 out of five. It's 4.2, not bad for fittings. You're not gonna get quite as many options as maybe some of the foot joys, but a healthy score. Traction, 4.4. Scoring decent on traction, and the traction you can see here, if you want a summer shoe that's really gonna bite and dig and grab that ground, 
It's very pimply here. I can see why that one is scoring well for traction and price. 4.9, these are aggressive on price. Probably one of the highest scores we've got from all of the shoes. Really good score there. That's a 4.4, our number three, summer gold shoe. Number two, New Balance. Yeah, you heard me. Now this is New Balance 574 Greens. Now I own a pair of these as trainers. 574s, I love 574s with the New Balance. Classic trainer look. Remember it's waterproof. Dyna Soft midsole, it's crush plus insole for extra cushioning, there's flexibility and it's got the spikes on the bottom. To be fair, the bottom is a little bit just the similar to the trainer I own. I mean, in all intents and purposes, it is just a 574 New Balance trainer for golfers. This was one of my favorites, to be fair. So when we got everyone wearing all the shoes and ranking, how did it go? So for style 4.9, no surprises. We are a cool bunch here at the Golf Shop Online. New Balance bang on trend at the moment in the world of fashion and crossing over into golf as well. So 4.9 for style, I get it. Comfort, 4.8. New Balance shoes, obviously as a running brand, comfort like just nails it. It is as comfortable as the trainer, feels as good, looks as good as the trainer. A few different colorways to the trainers, but comfort scoring high. Fit, 4.0, not scoring quite as high. Bit more limited on the size range. So they're all available, but getting stocks and making store stocks are in is tough with this shoe, as you can imagine for New Balance. So if you are wanting these, act really quick if your size is in stock. Traction 3.9, it is just the trainer sole. Compared to some of the others, it doesn't look like they're saying or doing much with the traction. I personally think it'll be enough traction for a summer shoe for most golfers. I would sacrifice any little traction, just wear it in dry conditions because I just think it looks super cool. Price 4.7, aggressive on price, it's New Balance. And so, you know, it's a worldwide fashion brand bleeding over into golf. That is our number two, that's a total score. So an average out at 4.5. What is number one then? It's Foot Joy, no surprises. They are number one shoe in golf and there's a reason for that. So this is the Pro SLX. You also get the Pro SLX Carbon available, a little bit more of a different price, but this one is such a great golf shoe. It's kind of everything that Foot Joy bring to golf shoes. So it's available in laces, it's got a boa fitting, it's got loads of different fittings as you would expect. So I imagine it's gonna score high in that um, category. Chromo skin leather, it's supple, it's lightweight, it's durable, it's waterproof. 3D modeled collar here as well. Like it's packed with tech. They've been making golf shoes for years. They don't muck about. So it's, you know, I, I can see why people were right in this one so high. And I think there's an element of trust with that brand on a golf shoe. So style, we're gonna come in at a 4.4. It's a really good blend of styling. Like it's close to say the New Balance. I think that looks a bit better, but it's maybe not as average looking as the Echo. Like the Echo is nice, but it's more of a basic looking golf shoe. So I think it sits in a really good spot. Comfort 4.9, almost maxes out on comfort. No surprises there. Super soft around the top, nice high on the top here at the back. Nice fitting options and the footbed is so soft. Traction 4.8, they don't muck around with traction. Look, I mean, it's their own design and they just keep tweaking it to try and get the most traction they can. The sole of this shoe is quite impressive with the amount of bobbles and the directions and how they're working for stability and how a shoe might work in a golf swing. It's a golf company, they make shoes for golf swing. Price, it does get rated down at 4.2 because you're gonna pay for that expertise a little bit more, but it does come in as our number one. Total score of 4.7 out of five. What do you think of our best of list? Which one did you prefer and why? I do love those New Balance, but I've got to admit, as somebody who tries to push in the ground hard, the tracks in on that shoe does appeal to me.